Have you ever wanted to switch off Zodiac ads temporarily or permanently? Today I'm going to show you two methods that we can use to disable all ads across the website. And to start, we jump into a Zodiac dashboard. And first we're going to disable all ads temporarily. We can go to Zodiac ads. Go down to the sidebar, click on split testing. From here, we have this option Zodiac ads traffic split. Here, we simply say update settings, and we've got multiple options here. We can reduce the amount of ads displaying on desktop, and the same for tablet and mobile, or we can totally disable all ads on this particular device. This is a, a, a good method if you are not sure if you want to disable the Zodiac or if you only wanted to disable ads to do a quick test. To disable ads uh, permanently, we can select these radio buttons and say save. Now all ads will be disabled. So just keep in mind that these settings can take some time to update. So if you if these settings don't reflect immediately on your site, then uh, just give it a couple of hours and over time when the caches update, uh, that uh, ads will automatically disappear. On the maximum, it should not take longer than eight hours. The next option to remove is Zodiac entirely off the website is to disable the integration method. In order for us to disable the integration method, we first need to establish how the site was integrated. Navigate to home page. From the home page, we can go to settings. And in settings, we can see under site integration, this particular website has been integrated with Cloudflare. Cloudflare is a really popular option with this integration. So let's practice uh, integration method down. Typically, there is three methods. The first one is the plugin method. Um, we are going to be disabling the plugin method during this video. The second method would be simply to integrate via name servers. Name server integration and Cloudflare integration are typically done on the same kind of method. There is slight differences in the method, but it is basically the same procedure. Moving forward, we are going to mainly focus on Cloudflare. Uh, there is three steps in this process to entirely disable a Zodiac. So let's get started. The first step in this process is to disconnect Cloudflare from a Zodiac dashboard. Click Disconnect Cloudflare. Now, Cloudflare is not integrated through a Zodiac, meaning that the traffic will not pass through a Zodiac. But that said, the traffic is still going to be sent through DNS. You might now, after you disconnect Cloudflare, have website problems. But don't worry, if you get an error, it's not an issue. We can uh, simply solve that by going to Cloudflare dashboard. Under Cloudflare dashboard, we can uh, navigate to DNS records. From this dashboard we can now see all the routing of dns in order for us to totally disable zodiac we need to remove all the dns so for this particular domain we can we notice that there's a record which is sending us to the particular hosting we verify that uh, this a record is here so if you do not have this a record you need to navigate to your hosting uh, this will work for your hosting um, regardless where your site is hosted. Uh, the only thing you are looking for is the actual IP address. And we can verify IP address here. Go back into uh, Cloudflare. Uh, we can simply do a search of the IP address and we can see the A record as is properly configured currently. The next DNS is sending us to a CDN and that is... Uh, sending us to a Zodiac. So we can go ahead and remove this. The way that we know this is it's going to say C name and we can also see CDN um, or a Zodiac uh, within the name section. So we can uh, remove that. 
the next C name is pointing us directly to the actual domain name. So this is also verified to be correct. Once you removed all Zodiac integrations, then you will have two records left. One A record with an IP address, and the second um, DNS record will be a C name for the WW, and that's pointing to your domain. The last step into this procedure uh, is to go into WordPress. Uh, on the plugins, you have Zodiac, and you can simply say deactivate. And that is the complete process.